can you please do a 10K challenge? 10,000 calories. People are still doing the 10K challenge. Come on, people. It's my video. I'm not just gonna eat 10,000 calories. We gotta go big. So let's do this. What is going on, everybody? Eric the Electric coming back to you guys again with another video. More importantly, another challenge. Everyone, it has been quite some time. Well, a little over three months to be precise since I've done a calorie challenge. And it's been even longer since I've done a calorie challenge all within one day, 24 hours. Now the most calories I've ever done in one day was right around 30,000 and that was in 2015. Oh baby Eric, just starting to do crazy things on YouTube. That challenge was insane. It was also insane because I had a little bit smaller of a stomach capacity. I know what you guys wanna see. You don't wanna just see supercharged menu challenges. You don't just wanna see, I guess, an hour worth of crazy eating. You wanna see 24 hours of crazy eating. Just a few months ago, I did 60,000 calories, well, 68,000 calories in a little under 60 hours. So let's see how many we can do in 24 hours. Guys, over the past few months, I've eaten monstrous cheeseburgers. I've eaten 72 ounce steaks. I've eaten two monstrous cheeseburgers. I've eaten gigantic pizzas. I've done crazy things, everybody. But we're gonna step it up a notch. Everyone, I'm gonna be attempting to eat 40,000 calories in 24 hours. Here are the rules for this challenge. Rule number one, I'm going to be minimizing my liquid calorie consumption as much as possible because guys, drinking your calories, it's for amateurs. We gotta make this as painful as possible. Two, I'm gonna show you guys how much I spend on each meal and that will be in the bottom right hand corner. Three, I have 24 hours to complete this challenge, not 25. 24. The monkey's telling me I need to do all this. Everyone, if you are ready to see stupidity at its finest, just Keep watching the video. Oh, this is gonna suck. Everyone, this is the supercharged cheat day challenge. We're going for 40,000 calories. Let's do this. <sighs> Here we go again. It's time to make some magic. So first meal is about to go down. The structure for today, everybody, is I can't snack and I can't do all that even though I'm probably gonna have to. Guys, this is the most calories I'm ever having to do in one day. And I'm not doing any liquid calories either, so this is gonna be, well, I'm gonna count the calories from liquid from my milk and everything from my cereal, because I'm gonna have a shit ton of cereal. And by shit ton of cereal, I mean a lot of cereal. It's time to start cooking. Alright, so it only took me like an hour to cook everything. Currently 8.52 in the morning, October 3rd. What we have in front of us, everybody, is a shit ton of cereal. We have eggs, we have toast, we have donuts, we have a classic American breakfast. A lot of sugar, a lot of fat, and a decent amount of protein. The total calories for this are going to be listed like right there. I'm going to try to get this entire thing in Nutella down. And of course we have some peanut butter as well, which is hiding right here. Oh yeah, and I also have some fruit, of course, because we got to start the day off right. Also, the total cost is gonna be right there too for this meal. We're starting off strong. I've never woken up and just started a food challenge before, so this is probably gonna be either the best thing I've ever done or the worst thing I've ever done. We got a long day ahead of us. Let's get to work. Snapchat crew. Oh yeah, guys, follow me on Snapchat, Eric the Electric, because you guys can know when all this is happening live, kind of live. As always, the question of the video is, what do we start with first? Donuts. Alrighty guys, and at 8.57 in the morning, we are ready to get this challenge underway. Let's do this.
Now this is a, uh, I'm just gonna shut up and eat. Man, oh my god, good. Coffee is very, very, very important with these guys. We have almonds on donuts, shaved almond stuff. Wow. Yeah, adds a nice crunch to the donut. This one's actually really good. I don't know why. And the thought just occurred to me. Why not just make this even more delicious, right? Now I probably am gonna save the rest of this for other meals, because I have some other shenanigans planned. We do have toast though, so it's, I mean, I'm gonna probably use like a quarter of this. Perfect. I think you guys have actually seen this before from me. Comment down below if you know what challenge I'm talking about. <sighs> Cinnamon bun. Dude, these donuts. Killer. I was gonna go to uh, Krispy Kreme, but you guys just saw that from me and I just didn't wanna give you guys a bunch of boring donuts from Krispy Kreme, even though they're not so boring. Not bad. This one's good. <sighs> this is like a Halloween dunk. All done with the donuts. Now I'm gonna get to the eggs that are probably cold. I'm stupid because I always do these challenges and I eat the things that get cold first, cold fastest, like the last, so. Trying to make something happen here, and these fucking almonds are all over my table. Onions are good. I actually cook pretty good. I've done better. I'm literally eating eggs with a spoon right now. In fact, these are like coconut eggs. Because like all I taste is coconut oil. Which there's nothing wrong with. I mean. We're trying to get calories in right now. Ugh. The sad part is I have so much food left. All right, well, we have this done. I have a shit ton of toast. Guess what? I also like Nutella. I don't love Nutella. I know a lot of you like Nutella, which is why I got this, but. So we have a fresh jar right there. Oh, that's a big Nutella dump right there. Uh, there we go. Nutella for days. This is insane. <laughs> We can also combine peanut butter and Nutella too. Nutella on that side and peanut butter on that side. And that, my friends, is a complete breakfast. Complete, by my standards. So complete. And sometimes I just like eating toast. The way it should be eaten, well, plain, which is good, really good. But then I remembered we have a lot of Nutella to get rid of. And by the way, yes, it is Nutella, not Nutella. Just believe me. I'm always right with these things, guys, come on. It's like a taco, it's like a Nutella taco, right? I mean, <laughs> kinda. Oh my gosh, the thought just occurred to me. I need fruit too. So good. I mean, Nutella actually isn't so bad anymore. I used to think it was overrated.
the good news is I'm out of Nutella. Fresh out, guys. Sorry. No more Nutella. I may have to use some peanut butter with these, but we have pumpkin spice Oreos. Now, I normally hate everything pumpkin, but these are limited edition, and I had to try them for the sake of the video, so we're gonna do that. Pumpkin spice Oreos. Wow. Not terrible. And there we have the pumpkin spice center. I give them, give them a seven out of 10. Now this is where the real magic happens, folks. Pumpkin and peanut butter. Yep. Oh good. <clears throat> oh, dude. Ugh. The last Oreo. And we still have toast. Oh, I have all the cereal to eat. Toast is done. Apple is done. About a fourth of the peanut butter jar done. We got the Nutella jar done. The final product of all of this madness is the cereal. Well guys, dude, I just need to wipe my face. This is terrible. I have one napkin and about a thousand pounds of Nutella on my face. Oh, should we do cinnamon toast crunch or the scoops first? Let's just do, let's do the scoops. Fun fact is I, uh, I've always wanted to try this cereal. There's only 1,900 calories in this entire box. Perfect. And there's a gardener outside of my apartment right now. Forget the noise, but we have food to eat. Oh, it's terrible. Two out of 10. The milk's at least pretty good. The cereal just isn't. I actually regret not getting more milk. Dude, we have a lot of cereal left. It's just one box. Dude. Last bit of cereal. Well, of this cereal. Oh my gosh. We have this box done. This is going right here. Now, Cinnamon Toast Crunch has been always a favorite of mine. Oh shit. Look at this, guys. That's a Pokemon trading card game. I didn't even know Pokemon was still out, more importantly. I have no idea why this looks like Golden Grams instead of Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but I guess they kind of look the same. Amazing. The milk is like the best part, or one of the best parts. <sighs> Ugh, we're almost done. Sad part is, I think this is like only a quarter of what I have to eat today. Alrighty guys, at the end of meal one, I have no idea how, I forgot an apple. Screw the apple right now. We're just trying to focus on surviving. This is the end of meal one. Now, it's time to go do what I do best, or one of the things I do best, other than eating. We got the yellow shorts on today, people. Oh my gosh, that was a lot of food. Let's do this. All I can taste is Nutella. I smell like Nutella. 
I feel like Nutella. Well guys, two hours later we're done and it is time for meal number two. Oh, I'm starting to feel it already. Oh gosh, this is gonna suck so much. So it is about 12.47. It's time for the next meal. It's time for the impossible Big Mac challenge with a few extras. And here we are at the Golden Ashes. Again. We're gonna be doing the impossible Big Mac challenge, everybody. And, um, hold on. I need some 10,000 calorie water. I've been super thirsty. Don't know how many calories is in the impossible Big Mac challenge, but this was basically a viral challenge that went around for a while and I never got to do it. So I'm gonna do that and a few more items. Can I can I get uh, four Big Macs, please? Uh, so, so four Big Macs and then four large orders of fries, please. And then uh, four chocolate shakes, large. Give me one second here. Unfortunately, we can't do shakes right now. Let's do four frappes, medium, please. Uh, let's do chocolate chip. For all four? Please, just one side salad with uh, ranch dressing, please. Alrighty gonna be $53. All right, cool. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. One more bite. Oh, she put the whipped cream on it. Ooh, I see it now. Thank you very much. You have a wonderful day, all right? One more bite. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Take care. Oh my Lord. This is gonna be actually pretty impossible. Oh, goodness gracious. Can't forget the frappes. And the Big Macs. Oh gosh, okay, so everybody, it is currently 132, October 3rd. Chocolate chip frappes, large fries, large Big Macs. We have to step it up a notch too, so I've got these. I already have uh, Cheetos uh, planned for tonight's dinner. And to snack on after this, if I'm still coherent, we have a large bag of mixed peanuts. Of course, everybody, I'll let you know how many calories we're at currently. And then after this meal is over, we'll see where we stand calorie-wise. So actually, I think it's better that I got the frappes, even though they were a little bit more expensive because chocolate shakes, I think, are only like 500 calories each. I think these are like 800 or something like that. Let's do the impossible, or not so impossible, Big Mac challenge. And I forgot to mention that I got a salad <laughs> because we gotta have greens with this. And here we go. That inside shot though, that inside shot. McDonald's fries are just the best. And these actually aren't terribly cold. They're still not bad though. First, fry. Mac combo is down. Shout out to Mac. Still have no idea what this sauce is actually made of. The roof of my mouth is like ready to like bleed. Probably is actually already bleeding. Now it's time to try one of these frappe things. Whipped cream is refreshing right now. This is chocolate chip. I like it. It's like a frappuccino. I get it now. Just keep a moment. Yes, I am using a spoon with this. Just kidding, that went. It's not gonna go very well. Well, first one is down. That's done, number three. Scooping the whipped cream off this and eating it like the way it is. <sighs> Gotta finish the Big Macs, two left. That one's extra saucy. This one, I should say. This is next. Third Big Mac is down. I did do this pretty quickly. Oh, man. Done. 
fries are all done. Fun fact about these Big Macs guys is I got them with no pickles. They are pickle free. That's right. That's just the way I like it. If you're with me on the no pickles, let me know down in the comments below. You probably like pickles though, because 99% of people like pickles. 99% of people over here. Don't take it personally. It's just, maybe I'm the real one. Okay, we're gonna have to get the fries ready. Oh, that's right. We are done with carnage. <laughs> Why did I get a salad? I'm trying to be healthy, right? I should dip the fries in this thing. Guys, my apologies if I keep sighing, but this shit is hard. This is very, very hard. Ugh. Especially when you're an idiot and you get salads. Oh shit. Whoops. Just christening the uh, new apartment carpet. Damn it. Ugh. Now we move on to Cheetos and nuts. 10 grams of fat per serving, eight servings per container. These are the Cheetos Bag of Bones. Is it about time for me to say the fitness joke again? Fitness? Fitness little Cheeto in my mouth. Just pretend like you never heard that. They're actually really good. They kind of remind me of, um, they're like white cheddar hot Cheetos. No, white cheddar Cheetos. Pirate's booty, they're amazing. I'm super studying. Salad, Cheetos. Salad. Cheetos. These are the worst things to eat large quantities of in one time. Man, my fingers, look at my fingers. They're all messed up. I'm gonna snack on these nuts and uh, do some social media stuff before I go to the gym. Fun facts, these nuts, this bag, I think I already said how many calories it has in it, but I love shelled peanuts. Peanuts are amazing. I have no idea how many calories on that, but I think I have dead left in like a half hour. There haven't been any holy shit balls moments yet, guys. Tonight, we might have one with what I'm gonna be making. But do this for me. If you guys have made it this far in the video, comment down below, peanut. Yeah, do that, and I'll show you some more. Uh, the goal is to get half this bag down, so half of it's like almost done. <clears throat> Alright guys, so we definitely got a little over half done. These things are so messy. What a life, guys. Trying to film a 40,000 calorie challenge while snacking on these nuts. I had to do at least one. Come on guys. Just admit it, you laughed, you laughed. I know you did. And that is the way, at least this peanut crumbles today, folks. It's time to go to the gym. Oh God, I smell like cheeseburgers. I'm hoping I don't die. I think like 15,000 calories left to eat. <laughs> Pray for me. This might suck a little bit. What's up? How's it going? Good? Well, what can I say, guys? Cheeseburgers, Big Macs, fries, McDonald's. 
they bring the PRs and some squats afterwards, and I'm feeling really, really good right now. You can say that uh, we definitely earned the next meal. Okay, let me do the box of six then, please. That'll do it. The total is gonna be $17.99. The extra frosting? Oh, no, thank you. I'm good. They got a lot of frosting on there, I swear. I know we double frosting. Guys, have I mentioned how important hydration is with challenges like this? As my friend Randy Santel says, water is nature's best and greatest laxative. I'm starting to feel better, everybody. I was bogged down a little bit. I'm still stoked that I hit that PR, but you guys aren't here for that. You're here to see me eat some food. So that's what we're gonna do right now. We got some Cinnabon, woo! I'm still, I have no idea why I'm excited about that, but guess what we also got? We got a hangry bar, because Eric is pretty hangry. <laughs> Fun fact, this box is like 5,800 or something calories in it, and I have a bunch of shelled peanuts I have to eat. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Oh, my balls. Whew. I have no idea why I just said my balls, but holy shit balls! That is a lot of Cinnabon. That is a colossal Cinnabon for you. And we have Cinnabon. <laughs> Dude, this is just, <laughs> this is America right now. America! Home of the free, home of the brave. I know what you're saying, Eric, just shut up and eat the Cinnabon. I will, okay? I'm getting to it. I have to think of a cringy one-liner, but I can't right now, so I'm just gonna shut up and eat. This is terrible, man. I think I'm just gonna have to accept the fact that I'm just gonna get destroyed, or at least my face is about to get destroyed because there's a shit ton of cinnamon icing on this. And just, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it just looks so glorious eating this. Now I know these are supposed to be heated up, but I cannot wait to get home because I'm not gonna let these sit in my car. Basically just being lazy. Wiping my face is pretty much pointless at this point, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Oh, these are so filling too. Oh, that is a very dense Cinnabon. I'm just waiting for somebody to see me eating Cinnabon in my car like a savage. I'm just so thirsty, but I don't want to drink because I'm so full. That's easier to eat. Maybe not, maybe not. We have two Cinnabons left. <sighs> Do you really need to double frost this? Like, honestly people, honestly, there's no reason to double frost something like this. Actually, there is a reason when Eric does cheat days. <laughs> Ugh, one, almost done with this. Final one, so much sugar. That seems like, this is like the first time I've like ever done a challenge in my car where it's actually seemed like that was way more calories. Like there's no way that was only 6,000 calories. It had to have been like at least eight. And we are uh, not so hangry anymore. I saw it in Target everybody and it was just so cute. I had to get it. Basically like the cutest 250 calories of my life. So cute. All right guys, so we got the rest of this bag of peanuts left. Call it the half. Dude, I remember when I did the 30,000 calorie cheat day. My stomach capacity was so much lower then. Baby Eric. I really hope I'm like close to 40K. I'm gonna have like numb fingernails after all this. I love my nuts though. I love my nuts a lot. Cacahuates. That means peanut in Spanish. All right? And we have the last peanut right here. Oh gosh. 
two nuts never tasted so good. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I had to say it. Time to go home now. We are here at Pan Express. It hurts so bad. And I still smell like cinnamon rolls. Pan Express has been obtained and we gotta make one more store run. <laughs> This last meal is gonna suck. 6.51, October 3rd still. Guys, this is honestly, it's just, I remember when I did the 30K, I was just like, dude, I'll never do that ever again. I'll never do that much calories ever in one day. And it's safe to say that I surpassed that level of stupidity today. Time to take a shower and make the final meal. Well, everyone, here we are, the final meal. The thought of just consuming peanut butter right now disgusts me. Good thing is I don't have to eat this entire thing, but see how far we get. We have a Reese's, I actually made a Reese's bar thing right here. You guys can check that out. We have Mac and Cheetos. I, I'm stupid and I actually got the flaming Hot Mac and Cheetos instead of regular Mac and Cheetos. Sesame chicken right here, which doesn't look the most appetizing right now, but I'm hoping that when I bite into this, it's gonna look actually pretty appetizing. So who could go wrong with some chow mein and, well I should say large chow mein and large fried rice, low sodium soy sauce, because we're trying to uh, watch the sodium today. It's 8.03, let's get to it everybody. Plate, Pan Express. Pan Express goes on plate. That is a decent size of chow mein. dump like the entire bottle on here. This is the final meal. Let's do it. Chicken's actually not bad. Much better. Die of like MSG poisoning by the end of this. Ugh. I could have done without the noodles, honestly. Dare I say that this is actually pretty spicy. I'm not even lying to you guys. And I haven't even gotten to the uh, Mac and Cheetos yet. Oh, dude, it was so bad not to use beverages. I did use the frappes for liquid calories, but they were minimal. Definitely would have been better if I got orange chicken. <sighs> That's all done. Let me go get those ice cream pints. Oh, dude, I can't even get up. These are the flaming Hot Mac and Cheetos. I have my water ready, even though I should have, I do have milk. <laughs> I have milk right here, in case it gets too bad. It looks hot and it looks really intimidating. It's actually not that hot. Yeah, they're not hot at all, actually. Oh 
milk is so good. Oh, oh, oh. That like took this meal from 1080p to 4K in like a matter of two seconds. Should be really good with ranch. Hitting the roof of my mouth, it's crazy. It hurts. Last one. So that's out of the way. Now, what I've been looking forward to the most, dessert. My favorite Ben & Jerry's pint, pistachio, pistachio. My mouth is actually on fire right now. I have to, I have to get in some of this ice cream. So this is pistachio, pistachio. Boom. It's like the perfect consistency for once. It's not terribly melted. And we got two prime pistachios right on top. Oh man. Yeah, that was much needed after this. Mac and Hell Cheetos. Almost done. Now, I already know what this tastes like. I'm really curious about this Reese's concoction that I made. That's just what it is. It's a concoction. I have no idea if this is actually going to come out good. And now, my friends. Oh, it smells like a Reese's peanut butter cup. <laughs> Let's try it out. This is a holy shit balls moment. Oh my. Oh my god. Just like, look at that. That's awesome. I mean, that's that's health right there. That's health and fitness. We're slowing down. We are slowing down. Peanut butter from earlier today. Peanut butter and chocolate and more peanut butter. Basically a Reese's peanut butter cup. As it's dripping chocolate, this is the last bite. Now we have half of this down. Reese's peanut butter cup. Oh my gosh, we've had enough peanut butter cup. Why do I have to get this? Cheers. And that is a pretty big peanut butter cup for being a mix in. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Peanut butter, Ben & Jerry's. For glory. Oh, I did have to put a little peanut butter in here. And guys, this is the last spoonful of sweetness. Oh my god. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Well guys, I just want to say thank you for watching the video. Hold on, product placement, right? So thank you for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, let me know down in the comments below. If you like seeing me torture, I understand. What you guys can do is, if you want to see more of these, if you want to see me keep doing these, support me on Patreon. What Patreon is, is a great way for you guys to support us YouTube creators, specifically me. You can actually choose any amount that you want to help each month to help me keep doing these. It helps me out a lot. Patreon link will be down below. Don't forget to follow me on my social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. You know the drill. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Let's roll that outro right about now. Go right about now.